Howdy y'all on Star Rider here. Uh, doing this live video on my electric sleeping bag that I have in my motorcycle trailer. Uh, Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. I've had some uh, people ask to see inside the trailer, so this will also be kind of like a uh, a dual uh, video for a look of inside the trailer and also the uh, sleeping bag, which I can uh, show you all a little bit about. So I'm going to switch the camera around. And we're going to take a look. Well, first off, we'll take a step outside, show you that I'm uh, here at this campsite at. Um, Fort Richardson, Texas State Historical Park, which is pretty cool. So anyway, this is the blanket here and the inside of my trailer. The trailer is four foot by six foot. I've had a lot of questions about that. And I am five foot nine. So when I'm laying down here, my feet touch the wall and, uh, it doesn't touch the other wall so it's just about about got an inch now the uh, sleeping bag here I got off of Amazon and it has three different areas these are the areas that it heats up at the front here and at the foot I don't know if you could see the uh, the stitching where that's at now you can buy this sleeping bag with a battery but i did not because i would just wanted to plug it into the uh, trailer battery and here is the pocket for the battery right there that it comes with if you choose to have that but i got an extension and it plugs into a usb port into an area down there and i have a button right here and if I click it, it's on high automatically. I click it again, goes to um, low and then medium. And if I hold it, it turns it off. And I just chose to take this sleeping bag and turn it inside out and zip it up. Let's see if I can show you over here zip it up and then just lay on top of it and it's been keeping me really really warm i've had no problem at all staying warm with this sleeping bag with two blankets and uh i got a quilt here that my mom made which i still have made from harley davidson t-shirts and i've got a uh i don't know what they call this this other blanket I was nice and toasty last night. It got kind of cold. So I turned the um, the heating element on the uh, sleeping bag and warmed right up. Not bad at all. Uh, I wish I had this sleeping bag a long time ago. It would have been a, a nice thing to have. So I'm going to switch the camera around and then show you the inside of the trailer, which inside it's only about 90% complete. There's some things that I haven't finished yet and some things that I wished I could do. All right, this is the trailer inside. And that's my computer bag there and some other stuff setting over there. And it's only made for one person. I've got some other charging cables. I've got my iPhone, a USB, and then my watch charger. I just set those right there. And they go down to a, a four port plug that's connected to the uh, 12 volt battery. I have two windows in here. That's where I usually set my drink. I need a cup holder in here. And then I have these uh, gas shocks holding up the, the door pretty cool I don't know if y'all have questions if you could put those in the, about that but <clears throat> the things that I need to finish with this I need to finish the uh, table here this lifts up and 
I want to have a table under there and then clear all this stuff out. So that is one thing. I would like to have some electric actuators instead of the uh, the cable pulley system here because it's rubbing here on all four points, but it still does all right. Just goes up and down. There's the cable that goes to the fan. I have a light to put around there, but I haven't done that either. Uh, very, it, it works great. If it's hot, you turn the fan on, it cools it off. And the one last, one last thing I need to get done is I need to put the uh, a little rubber thing that attaches to here and goes up. So it'll seal off the the uh, the crack here when it's really cold. It doesn't get wet in here at all, but you can probably see it better right there. Yeah. So that is that is the inside of the trailer, and I hope that is uh, you finally get to take a look inside. Yeah. On my uh, YouTube channel, there's a whole series on my trailer build that I built this out. So if you want to see the details of the storage under the bed and what's happening where the battery is and all that, you can see it there. So, and I appreciate everybody's support, by the way. Um, I'm headed over to Cisco, Texas. I'm going to uh, Mineral Wells tomorrow, and then I'll be headed further uh, west but next week i gotta be in uh, mineral wells for a geocaching challenge and festival which ought to be pretty interesting so that's where i'm headed so i'm just kind of wandering around i was in uh, decatur the day before really neat little town if you ever have not been to, to decatur you need to go very cool got a neat courthouse too all right that is it i am Thanks for the thumbs up. Thanks for uh, uh, y'all's support. If you don't know what I'm doing, I've been traveling around the country for a little over a two and a half years raising awareness and money for the cure to diabetes in memory of my son. And if you want to uh, donate to that cause, you can go to writingforacure.com. All that money goes straight to the American Diabetes Association. And if you want to support me, go to LoneStarRider.com. There's a place for that. All right, guys, I hope you're having an awesome day. I am. So catch y'all on the road.